Today we're going to take a look at Christian Light Education's Science 4 program. It comes with a textbook, an answer key, and a quiz and test answer key. These are all required for the course. It also comes with five light units for a total of 80 lessons. There's two quizzes and one test per light unit. And then there's also an optional teacher guide, which we'll take a look at. Here is the textbook. It was copywritten in 2025. There's 318 pages. Here's the table of contents. Chapters 1 through 3 are on animals. Chapters 4, 5, and 6 are on plants. Chapters 7, 8, and 9 is about the earth, atmosphere, astronomy. Chapters 10 through 12 cover matter, force, friction, simple machines, energy and heat, and finally chapters 13 through 15 cover magnetism and electricity. Here is an example of a typical reading. This is the very beginning of the book. Chapter 1, The Wonder of Creation. There's one, two, three, four pages of reading and some study questions. The next section here, The Wonder of Life, you'll have your vocabulary words. There's four pages of reading, and some study questions. This chapter four is on the characteristics of plants. You have your vocabulary words, talks to you about absorbing and carrying water. It's full color. And then there's also an activity here to do. Just gonna give you a little flip through. Some more, these gray boxes are all activities. This is chapter nine about the sun, earth, and moon. And this is about the solar system. And here's another example, how the ears hear sound. Tells you about the auditory nerve, the cochlea, ear canal, eardrum, how hearing works. Hearing loss and protection, history of hearing aids, a little bit about sign language, and then next, learning about light and light sources. There's an activity here. In the back, there's also a glossary for all the vocabulary words and an index. This is Light Unit 401. Three sections, chapter one, the wonder of science and animals, chapter two, vertebrates, animals with backbones, and chapter three, invertebrates, animals without backbones. So there will be an exploring the lesson. So this first lesson was only the front and back of one page. The next lesson, the wonder of life. Now they're starting to have a we remember the review because this is a typical CLE course. Then lesson three, exploring the lesson, and then finally we remember. So there are about three pages of work for each lesson. Birds, reptiles, amphibians, fish. This is the test that you'll pull out before giving the workbook to your child. They're labeling here the parts of an insect, they have vocabulary words, some matching, invertebrates, anthropods, and insects, metamorphosis, a lot of labeling. There's an extra activity. And then these are the quizzes that we give for lessons five and 10. They're double-sided pages. This is the fifth and final light unit. Section one is on sound, section two is on light, and section three is on magnetism and electricity. What is sound? Sound and matter. So you have two pages of the lesson and one page that we remember. A lot of filling in the blanks, ordering, 
multiple choice, some extra activities. How your eyes see light, there's the test. The test here has matching, circling the correct word, and fill in the blank. And there's some true and false here. We have a Venn diagram here. There's a drawing activity. A lesson about magnetism, parts of the eye, and here electricity, labeling the load, power source, switch, and wire in the parts of a circuit. Making an electromagnet. Self-check is before the test. There's another extra activity here, and then finally the two quizzes. The answer keys are very simple. This is the answer key for the light units. It's just the pages of the light units, except it has the answers. It's nice and thin, easy to carry around. And we also have the quiz and test answer key, which is the answers to just the quizzes and tests. That's in a separate book. This is the teacher guide, it is optional. It does not contain the answers to the light units in the test, so you'll still need to get the answer keys if you have the teacher guide. I'll just show you a little bit of what's inside. It has the objectives, class preparation, teaching plan, discussing the lesson for every lesson. It shows you what you can write on the board to explain the concepts. There is review and additional activities. Here it has instructions for a nature notebook and more activities and experiments. So these are experiments that are only in the teacher guide that will not be in the light units or the textbooks, although there are plenty of activities in those as well. Here there is an extra poem that could be read and there are recommended books for a lot of the lessons. So if you like living books in your homeschool, um, there is always a book list here as well. Here we have um, the additional activities, the nature notebook, activities, experiments. It'll say here that the child can work through the experiment chart from the appendix. I'll show you what's in the appendix. The appendix has an extensive supply of graphic organizers and charts that could be used in the lessons. Here are some of them. They also have working through the scientific method and lab safety, researching questions, writing a hypothesis, all kinds of worksheets and re reproducible experiment charts. So these are the charts that explain the different types of experiments that can be done. There are lots of them here. And then there are games, review games and activities. These are all the sheets, the reproducible sheets for the games and the extra activities. All of these reproducibles are also available in this flash drive that's in the back of the book. So this is a pretty hefty book, but it's packed with a lot of information. I hope this has helped you to have a peek inside of CLE's new science program. Uh, have a blessed day. Thank you for watching.